I've got some big news. You know I buy and sell bikes, it's just what I do. This one's a little bit different. This one was a little bit rushed, but a little bit different. And I just couldn't say no. I've had my eye on this bike for a while. There was none available. In fact, I bought the last one in Australia. All aboard! I did I look I love that street glide I really really love that street glide great memories border patrol thousands of k's guys we're in the middle of covid can you please all stand 1.5 metres apart? Now, I've got a couple of surprises here. The first one is, for those of you that remember, my 1,000 Ks to the nation's capital. This fella has come back from Belgium to join me, my son Josh. I'm back. <laughs> the only difference is, last time he was here, there was a little bit of a height difference. Yeah. So this was the last one in Australia for 2021. And let's check it out.
has been long time no see back into it for 2022 i hope you had a wonderful christmas and uh new year with your families and stayed safe and got some rest from work or whatever your plans were i uh have had a very very busy period that's for sure uh, my son joshua coming over from uh, from brussels got here on the 23rd of december just before christmas which was great so we got to spend christmas together and uh, enjoy each other's company and uh, do all those sorts of things which was absolutely wonderful we haven't seen him for two years uh, 2019 was his last trip out yeah, so so great to see uh, see him and have some relaxing time away from the business uh, swimming and uh, eating and relaxing and all that good stuff anyway uh, on the new wheels where did I get the bike how did it come about that's the big uh, that's the big story I guess when I'm after something I do hunt and pursue it's a bit like catch and kill you know I put a call out I know a lot of people at Harley Davidson and uh, some wonderful folk and yeah I was uh, I was told very clearly unanimously that there was no more road glide CVOs in the country uh, available to order and uh, you know 2022 models will be coming out uh, did I want to wait? No, the colours have not been released. Well, not at this time of me making this video. Uh, they had not been released. So, and then lo and behold, I uh, was lucky enough to find one on bike sales that popped up. And uh, I rang the guy and said to him at the dealer, where did you get it from? Imagine a crashing a Harley dealership as to where they got their motorcycles from. Because I pretty much knew, because I pretty much knew there was none left in the country, and he said, "You're absolutely right. This one arrived three days ago, and it was a customer customer's order. They rang the customer to let him know his bike was in, and uh, he'd ordered it six or seven months ago, and uh, had a change of plans. The order was cancelled. The bike became available, and." Uh, as they say, quick and the dead. So what did I do? I hired a motorcycle trailer, jumped on the highway, and shot straight up to the Gold Coast. The Gold Coast is in Queensland, for those that aren't in Australia. So I rode from my state up to Queensland. It was about an 800 kilometre drive. And I towed the street glide up there we traded her in and uh, loaded uh, this beautiful beast onto the trailer and, and drove back to Sydney and here we are so this bike has had some work done to it so I won't go into that now in this video but um, I'll run you through that in separate videos as to, to what has been done uh, and what I've done to it etc just to enhance the motorcycle and uh, yeah, and so pretty exciting. It's going in tomorrow morning to be wrapped. So that's happening tomorrow morning. I found a guy that seems pretty dedicated to the cause. The company that did the Street Glide CVO uh, claim they aren't doing motorcycles anymore. I think they must have just had a really good guy and I got lucky and had him and they've lost that guy. So I found another guy that's got a seemingly pretty good business so we're going to go down we'll do a little bit of a vlog with him it's going to be a two-day wrap so let's see how this thing's going to come out anyway we're just about to leave and go and pick up the beast it's all been wrapped let's go and check it out let's see how awesome this guy is at his job at his detail attention to detail let's go and check it out pick up the bike i've also had the top box wrapped very exciting of the color match box for the last bike. So we got that wrap to uh, come closer to matching this, this new bike. So let's go and check it out. So I've just come down to pick up the bike. I'm down here at Roblox with Ollie. And how excited am I, guys? You know, I've wrapped a number of bikes, cars, and I've never seen a wrap job like this.
I'm very, very happy. I'm not an easy person to impress, but I have actually found somebody that's probably about as ain't, uh, I shouldn't say that word on OCD. camera. OCD. OCD, as I am. Meet Ollie from Roadblock. Hello. Welcome. There you go, welcome. Mate, there you go. Thanks very much for fitting the bike in, in your busy schedule and uh, being able to punch it out over, I suppose, about four or five days or whatever it was. Yeah. Yeah. Um, a very, very fickle customer in me and um, I've come to pick the bike up and I'm just absolutely overwhelmed you with say, excitement. You say fickle, but I think you've been pretty good. Am I? Oh, yeah, right. So like, you've got worse customers than me. Wow. Oh. Okay, mate. That's awesome. So, yeah. So very, very, uh, you know, I'm very OCD is the right word. And... Uh, I've come down to pick the bike up and I am just so, so happy. We're going to take a look at the bike in a minute. Uh, this is Ollie's business. His showroom's probably cleaner than my bedroom. That's actually not a joke. Have a look around. There's even curtains in it. Hello. Uh, just such a beautiful workspace and uh, he clearly takes a lot of pride in, 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 you know, in what you do. And um, how long have you been in business now, mate? Been doing wrapping and paint protection for about seven or eight years now. Yep. Uh, this space is only fresh though in, since May. Yeah. So nice. I've recently got the chance to fit it out how we want it with the curtains and the, you know, the flooring and nice. really purpose built. Yeah. So you definitely know beginning with wrapping, obviously the job on the bike tells that, but um, there you go. So let's take a look at the motorcycle. Let's have a look at some of the detail that's been gone into it. And also Ollie did the top box, my, uh, tool pack that I had on the previous street glide, which was colour matched. We did that in a gloss black to match the new bike. Let's take it, take a look and check it out. Guys, I can't tell you how impressed I am. That's a quick look at the bike. It looks so much, as I always say, so much better in person to marry up the colors, but also to see the work that Ollie's done with the wrap. Very, very impressed. I'm gonna stick it up on the screen, Roadblock. You can always message me and I'll give you Ollie's details. He's done a brilliant, brilliant job. Uh, you don't come to Ollie because he's the cheapest. You come here because he's the best and he's very, very good. And I've got to tell you, I'm very, very happy and I'm not an easy guy to please. So stay tuned, guys. Back on channel. More to come. Happy New Year and look forward to reconnecting with you all uh, for some good videos upcoming. Take care of yourselves.